We're here at the LA Chargers facility with the team's rookies and the ladies of Galvanize. I'm Jenna Duddleston, and today you get to meet Kaiser White. This fourth round draft pick from West Virginia University is living out his dream in a very unique way because he gets to do it with his two other brothers in the league. Okay. All right, so let's just start off with saying how absolutely awesome it is that you and your two other brothers are all in the NFL. What is that like? Uh, it's a dream come true since uh, we were little kids. We all like kind of just spoken into existence. Like I know it was far fetched at the time, but we just always like spoke about it and said how it would happen one day. And just to be here now, it's just crazy. Yeah, it's amazing. And then I think what most people, you know, it's easy to think of you and your two other brothers, but you're actually one of seven. So very large family dynamic. What is that family group text like? Uh, it's crazy. We got it. Like you said, we got a family group text. Uh, we text every day. Uh, good morning. Good night. Uh, how's the day going? So it's just a real tight knit family. A lot of like funny gifs and oh, videos. Yeah, for sure, for okay. Sure. <laughs> All making jokes about each other. Awesome. Each other. All right, we're gonna do rapid fire questions. Okay, so it's got to be the first sibling that comes to your mind. All right. Are you ready? Yeah. Okay. Most competitive. Me. Chillest. Uh, Quran. Most likely to steal food off your plate. Okay. Biggest liar. I don't know. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Biggest sweet talker. Kev. Kev. Best dancer. Uh, my sister Nyasia. Funniest. Kev. Weirdest. Karan. Sorest loser. Mm, my sister Kaya. Okay. And mom's favorite. Me. <laughs> Dad's favorite. Me. Okay. <laughs> All right. Good answers. So growing up in that environment and being in, like, you're always competing with your siblings, really. And right now you're competing for, you know, your job. You're competing. You're on the biggest stage of your life right now. But I'm thinking that's just like another Tuesday in your household. Yeah, I mean, it really stems from my dad. Like, he's a real competitive person. So ever since we were younger, he, he's hard on us. Uh, he's not going to take it easy to let us win, to, you know, put a smile on our face because life isn't easy. So that's just kind of something they implemented it us at a young age so now we can just feel like we can handle anything yeah. and you had said too that um, both your mom and dad didn't have the best upbringing things were really tough on them but they knew that once they started a family they wanted to make things better yeah for um, their family. yeah so just like the town they come yeah. from uh, my mom comes from a big family my dad it was just him his mom uh, his mom him and his sister and his father had passed away when he was kind of uh, younger like in his 20s, so he was always like the provider. So, I mean, I just want to make the best life for them as possible, just to give them something they never had growing up. Um, what is it about their work ethic and determination to make things better for you guys? How does that motivate you today? I mean, just to see them go hard for seven kids, day in, day out, uh, never look tired, you know? They never uh, showed us that it was hard or difficult. So that just kind of rubbed off on me. If they can do it with seven kids, I mean, I can handle anything, really. Very true. Thank you so much for your time, and good Thank luck you. this year. Appreciate it. Yeah. Great job. Thank you.